What up, green kitties? Meow. 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 What up, y'all? I'm at home. Okay, I just got off the tub. And I'm hungry, y'all. And it's 9 o'clock. And so, I'm hungry. And I'm like, you know what? Let me... While I'm still kind of up, let me go on and pull up somewhere. Probably a Del Taco or a Taco Bell or something. Let me pull up and go get me something to eat. Because I'm one of those people that if I don't satisfy my craving even a little bit, um, I won't be able to go to bed. And then I'll be, I'm the one that gets up at like 4 or 5 in the morning or 3 in the morning out getting food and i don't like doing that especially due to the holidays you know it's not safe so while my husband is still up and everything i'm like let me just go and get me something to eat um so i have me a warm it's really cold it was cold earlier today but it's nighttime now so i have my mini mouse sweater and my mini mouse pants and then I put some socks on with my granny slippers. I love these slippers, y'all. They're so warm. And they're not heavy. Like, it feels like nothing is on my feet, y'all. Um, And I was like, you know what? Let me talk to you guys. I am really, you know, making a video. And when I said I was making um, a video every, every day in December, I meant I'm making multiple videos a day. Because I already give you guys a video a day, damn near. So that wouldn't have been a treat. <clears throat> but I'm, I'm reminding myself to give you guys multiple videos, which I think I do that too. So I don't know. Anyway, so my nightcap. Yeah, I didn't get to see my nightcap, but this is my nightcap, y'all. So I just got off the tub. Mm, my neck. <clears throat> My neck is a little tense because I have horrible pillows, you guys. Horrible pillows. And I'm really upset, you know, because I spent a lot of money on pillows and I have not found my perfect one yet. A perfect fit. I got the my pillow on you get on TV. I went to Macy's. I went all over to get pillows and I still have not found the right one. And so because of that, my neck right here, like oh so i have a massage chair right here but it, you can tell i don't use it because i have my purse and my books and everything in there but that's my massage chair it's really nice it go to different levels it also warms up and you can also plug it up to your phone and you can hear music and all of that but i normally just watch tv while i'm in there I'm probably going to use that tonight because my neck is hurting and I need to be untensed. So anyway, that's my nightcap, guys. Um, if you guys don't know, sometimes, well, you guys do know, it's hard for me to sleep. So I help myself by taking Benadryl. Um, I think I was told you guys before. Um, it just calms me down. It doesn't really knock me out like... <sighs> But it helps me, like, calm myself down, you know? Instead of taking, like, Advil PM or, you know, something else. I've tried Sleepy Time Tea. And it was okay. Like, it used to work. Or it, it has worked a couple of times um, from, from the store, grocery store. But I don't know. I'm not really a big tea type of person. You know, so I think, though, I'm going to try, since it's cold outside, I think I'm going to try to go and see about it again. Um, I've taken an egg. Uh, downstairs, he should be. Okay, what do you want? Okay, well, go tell him. My bad, y'all. I've taken um, melatonin. I've taken all type of healthy things to try to go to sleep. And it'll relax my body. But this just seems like it works better than anything for me. You guys need to go and get in your bed. Go, go to bed, Zoraya. Jules, come here. Hold on, y'all. What do you want? 
No, you're at my door, so what do you want? I wanted to ask you something. Go ahead. I want to ask you to have my phone. Where are you from? I mean, to have your phone. Can you have my phone? Uh -huh. It's a phone right there you can plug up and try to use. I don't I, I don't know who phone that is. Plug it up. Use it somebody's charger. I don't have the phone. It's charged yet. Huh? I don't have it charged yet. Well, I don't know what to tell you. Ask your sister. I don't know what to tell you. Where's your phone and your charger? Where's your charger? Oh, y'all, I'm tired. I've been with my kids all day, all of them, y'all. That's why me and my husband split kids. So I'll take two one day, and he'll take one, or either I'll take, but he never takes all three of them. Like, I have all three of them. Whew. And it wasn't so much them. You know, they're kids. They're going to do what kids do, period, okay? Um, I've had them long enough to know what they do. It's that it's other people now. Um, the stores are super busy uh, due to the holidays. People are rushing. It's a lot going on. Plus, we st we have a, a damn corona going on still. So I have to make sure that they're safe. They're distancing. I have to make sure that, you know, they're not just putting their hands on everything. You know, it's already a big situation just having kids shopping. In the holiday season, it's horrible, okay? And then you want to put this goddamn disease out here, okay? It's even worse, okay? So, it, it definitely have tired me out because I went to a couple of stores and they just put their hands on the ground. They was doing flips and shit, you know. Uh, they was putting their hands on all type of shit. And I'm like, don't do that! I'm up here running around, putting hand sanitizer, looking at my phone, trying to find, get the shit that I need off my list. You know, the lines are long. People are getting agitated. Not at me, but just, you know, at workers because they're moving slow. So it was just it was just a whole lot. So I'm telling you, that's why, you know, it's a good and a bad thing. It's a good thing that I got my stuff, like, kind of early. But it's a bad thing because other people also is getting their stuff early. But at least I'm not last, you know? Like, I don't have to worry about it next week or the week after, you know? So I'm happy that I'll be away from that shortly and be back in my house quarantining, okay? So anyway... Yeah, so my kids tired have been tiring me out a little bit more than normal because the world we live in right now. Um, but like back to what I was saying, so I take a whole cup of this and I like this because like I said, it calms me all the way down. Like it it it, it loosens my body. It, you know, my body is tight. I take this and it loosens me. Now, it doesn't help me fall directly to sleep, but it'll make me tired enough. And if I lay somewhere long enough, I will nod off. So, um, yeah. So, that's that. I don't swallow pills. You guys know that. Um, I'm scared to choke and die. <laughs> so, I don't swallow any pills at all. I don't really swallow food. I don't swallow um, nothing but liquid drinks and shit. Liquid stuff. Um, I do have two uh, pill crushers or whatever, but I don't I don't think you can crush PM pills because it's a time released, and I believe when you crush it all at one time, it takes it and it gives you all that dose at one time. Now that's what I was told from the pharmacy, and I don't want to overdose on no damn Advil PMs. Okay, so this I have found out work better for me. And um, this is what I do. So within, I'm kind of already tired, as you guys can see. Because today was just, I'm already tired. Um, but this right here just adds on to really just calming me down. Because I can fight my tired. Like, this type of tired I am, I can fight this. 
Meaning, let a good show come on or, you know what I'm saying, let me and my husband get into a conversation. I can make myself up again. I can wake my, me up again, you know. <laughs> but when I have this, no matter what I hear, I'm still in a cool place. You, you feel me? So, if you guys have any suggestions, I've did the healthy stuff. I did the, um, I've did the, um, the tea, sleepy time tea. Hold on, y'all. And this is so nasty, y'all. Oh, the flavor is disgusting. Hold on. Mmm. Woo! Ooh. Ooh. Sorry, y'all. Hold on, y'all. I got hand sanitizer. Because it's sticky. <clears throat> so, if y'all know anything else, let me know. People say warm milk. But y'all know I don't drink milk like that. I don't drink milk at all. No, I do have almond milk. But I, I don't even play like that with milk. Almond milk at all. None of that. So, I just said fuck it. Anyway, I wanted to tell y'all. Just say hey. But, you guys, I bought this. My phone have never looked as clean as it look now, y'all. This shit here in dust for electronics, screen electronics, surface cleaning wipes, TV, laptops, computers, tablets, keyboards, video game system, streaming services. When I tell you alcohol and ammonia free, when I tell you this shit right here, y'all, and I believe I got it from Walmart. Pick this shit up. Y'all, I'm on this. I've had it in my cabinet for a while now, right? But I'm letting my kids use my cell phones, right? Because I am not paying their bill. Because they keep losing their phones and this and that. So I stopped paying their bill. But I have internet, so they know how to connect the internet uh, to make their phone work. So that's what we've been doing, right? But, you know, they're young. So, you know, once we get one problem solved, the second problem is they lost their chargers. And they can't find this. And we go through all this shit. So sometimes I'm like, okay, you can use my charger. At other times, I'm like, fuck the charger. I don't care. So sometimes when I get to that mode, fuck the chargers, I don't care. They want to use my phone. For example, my son just came in here, and he want to use my phone. Now, mind you, each one of them got two phones apiece because I bought them a phone, and their grandparents bought them a phone. What? I'm not playing. Bye. Um. So, anyways, back to the hand stuff. So, um, I've been letting my kids use my phone. And y'all know kids is dirty. Like, kids' hands are fucking disgusting. And, I, and my phone is touch phones. Like, damn near everybody, right? So, you know, they touching and they doing this and doing that. And, you know, all that shit with my... Oh, I'm like, oh, my God. So, the first time I was using some baby wipes, right? No, not baby wipes. Them wipes that got bacteria type shit. But it was, like, fucking my phone up a little bit, right? I was like, fuck, I can't use that. So, I remembered I had bought those. So, yesterday, I said, let me clean my phone. Let me just do it. And when I tell y'all the camera look better, y'all, my phone look brand, all my phones look brand fucking new, y'all. And it didn't fuck up my phone. Because I was like, fuck, I hope it don't fuck up my phone. Because I'm just wiping it and wiping it and, you know. And it, but it didn't. But it did not fuck up my phone. And y'all, it's super. You could tell the the phone is really clean. And I suggest, due to this bullshit going on in the world, you should clean your phone at least once a day, if not more. You know, because if you're like me, 
I multitask with all my phones. So sometimes my phones are on counters. Some, you know, I move around with my phones and they be in places that maybe are not, you know, good places, you know, as far as hand, sand, you know, hand cleansing, cleansiness. So, yeah, I rec recommend that. It was really cool. I feel more confident <laughs> with my kids now using my phone. Now I know I got clean and wipes and stuff for the electronics. So I just thought I should share that with you guys. See these mother tuckers. It's like, I don't understand how they don't hear me. I just told them I'm not playing. I just told them to lay down. We've been gone all day. They've had everything they've asked for. I am tired. It is time for them to lay down. And they in the hallway arguing about something. I'm telling you. Jewels and Zariah, put your phones down and get in the bed. Now it's no phone. Get in the bed and there's no phones. Amir, did you find your daddy? Yeah. Okay, did you use the restroom? Yeah. You did? Yeah. Okay, go give your... Okay, bye. Go get in the bed. Okay. Zariah and Jewels, turn your phones off and get in the bed. That's the problem. If I got to get into it, everybody going to bed. So, I just got on here, y'all, to say, hey, um, I had a good day today. I was able to get a lot of things done. Um, I wasn't able to make it to a real grocery store. So, tomorrow, I'll get the chicken and the other little things that I need. It'll give me something to do tomorrow, you know? Um, what else? That's it, y'all. I'm going to show you guys what my uh, mother-in-law, which is my baby daddy mom, came and brought. I told you guys she brought some stuff last week that was out in a garage or whatever. And then she came this week <clears throat> to bring the rest of her things. I mean, the rest of the kids' gifts and stuff. So they're going to have a really, 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 really good Christmas. Actually, a better Christmas than I even thought they were going to have. Because I bought them a whole lot of stuff that's in my trunk. I need to get it out. But I bought them a whole lot of stuff. Y'all know that. I spent $700 on the guys. Between three of, three of them. Sorry, y'all. It's getting dark. But hold on. And then she came and brought a lot of shit. I'm going to turn the light on one second, y'all. Let me lock my door. Yes, I have a lock on my door. My whole house got locks all over. I don't play that shit. But anyways, I'm going to show you what it looks like down up here. Look, y'all. See how I got to finish my tree? I still got to put more lights. I got to put the ornament. And then I have a Christmas... Um, a uh, tree skirt, but but she came and all of that, y'all. <laughs> yeah. Yay. And then she got it's more stuff there, and then yeah, and then I bought them. That's more decorations I got to put up, and then that's more like little house shoes and stuff. So they're gonna have a really good Christmas. Also, it's some stuff in the garage. And in my trunk. She bought my daughter some Uggs. See? Yeah. She bought her two pair black in this color right here. So that was cool. And, um, yeah. I'm trying to get rid of them to go get me something to eat. But I'm going to get something to eat. You hungry? Yeah. Hold on, y'all. I'm trying to show y'all the garage. Hold on. And then this is more stuff. More gifts here. And more gifts here. And then those two bags are all the clothes. Why is it not like the dog poo pooed in here? The dog was in here? No, that day we did let them. Oh, okay. Hold on. Let me open the garage. Hold on. My bad, y'all. So, anyway. Gotta go. Bye.